Hello everybody, it's me, Arjun324, and today is Sunday, so I'm going to batten down and get as many gameplay videos done as possible. So right now I'm just going to do more gender bender. next is probably going to be Portal, and maybe a Town of Salem, or maybe something else. Probably not something else, but, you know, let's just get going. Autoplay. Jeez, you're exhausted, and you're adjusted quickly. <laughs> yeah. This universe seems to be filled with people who can't accept this fact, and people that are quick to accept. At least that's what it looks like on the surface. Because this is the first... This is the first storyline that came out. And then as things went along, the characters became more developed. Not more, not not much developed, but still developed in some way. <sighs> yeah, water makes anybody feel better. Don't worry, Yale. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. And I have a runny nose, so sorry if I sound sick again. Jeez, you're eccentric. I need a little bit of water. Yeah, these guys, these guys adjust way too quickly. I would exactly agree with Yale on this. Ah, damn it, I forgot to turn on my stopwatch so I could tell when I would get done. I'm gonna say two minutes have passed, so I'm just gonna subtract two. Yeah, that's what it is. You're awesome. Yeah, considering that these guys have ways crazy hair colors and giant boobs anywhere, I'd, sup I'd assume that... <laughs> Increased intelligence wouldn't be all that surprising. Yeah, Neil, yeah, all of us wishes we became super smart. <sighs> yeah, yeah, this is exactly what I would assume would be wrong if they've tested. Ha. Ha, ha, ha. Just in case you thought that they were mad scientists. Yes, they've tested it. And of course, Yale doesn't believe them, and I don't think any of us believe them either. So... Um, I wouldn't be so eager to take the serum. I would, I would, I would just wait. Then again, that's just my personal opinion. Some reason I'm not so sure. You know, I just noticed this. I just noticed this, but their eye color and hair color, all of them match. Neon green for. Oh, okay, that's different. That dialogue was different twice before. At first, at first, it was just. Yale dialogue. And then there was some sort of glitch, I assume, where the dialogue switched to Lynn's for a second, and now it's, and now it's changed. I'm not going to complain about it, it's just convenient. I really have no other way to say it. Okay, what was I saying before? Oh yeah. Dina's eyes and hair are neon green. Lynn and... Lynn's hair and eye color looks like a sort of, I don't know, magenta? I don't know. And then of course Yale's eye and hair color are both brown. Oh yeah, that's really saying something. Dina, don't steal my lines! Is that so? Then why didn't it work, Lynn? Come on. 
you're, you're super smart and you didn't take into account some sort of technical issues that could arise. <coughs> oh sure, it is reversible. Or is it just gonna make them bigger like last time? Alright, yeah, we get it. Reasonable you. All of us would be reasonable just like you. Hey. If you're supposed to be angry, then why are you looking cute? Okay. Why am I even worrying about that? Oh yes, because Yale's character design is the only one I actually give a damn about. Oh, you did not just go there. You did not just go there. <laughs> Deal with the original girl form. Oh yes! Okay. Okay, yes. See, I told you this was gonna happen. Oh, okay, three, four, five. Jesus! You gotta wonder, you gotta wonder, Yale's arm's got to be sore after 11 syringes that were shoved into her arm. Or him. Physically, Yale is a girl, but mentally, still a guy. You get the idea. You know, I wonder if my computer is fast enough to record Five Nights at Freddy's. That'd be just a cash grab at, my, at this point, or in this case, view grab. But the game runs fine, like, sort of. So there's no reason that recording it should be any difficult, any more difficult. Stutter. I have a bad stutter. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can perform ser you can prepare serums perfectly all day long, but still there's that random variable. It doesn't matter if you're in science or math or game design. There's always gonna be that random variable that messes everything up. Oh yeah. Yale stuck with him for the next few days. That winter's definitely gonna have some juice on him. Okay, Yale, we got the point. Okay, you've brought that up before, Yale. Oh my god. Still only still only still only a fraction as annoying and bitchy as my brother. Because he could get to be a handful whenever him and my dad get into an argument. I mean, one time last week, I was outside watching my baby brother in his sandbox, and I swear, my bro my dad and my brother got so loud you could hear them through the brick walls. I am not even kidding. <sighs> Lynn, you're not really helping things. Yale doesn't exactly want to look attractive. What are you going to do about class? Easy. You could just call in sick. Er, I guess that wouldn't really work. Yeah, they're, those are superiors in business. People in school, especially people in high school or college, they're, they'd get really immature about it. And they wouldn't treat it as some sort of tragedy, like some like a suicide or a death. <gasps> Something like this people would just be immature about. Especially where I go to school. In fact, I'm pretty sure that a lot of them don't even know how to work their technology. Oh, bandages. Why didn't you think of that last time? Okay, Lynn, we get it. You love teasing ale. That's enough. I was gonna go see the SpongeBob movie this weekend. Tickets, though, are pretty high in price, so I'm gonna go see it during the Mardi Gras holiday. But I've heard that it's good, and I've heard that it's gonna make over 50 million this weekend. 
this probably would be a good time to have the old show that I had moving money. But I've decided that that phase of my life is gone. So if you're a long-time subscriber and you remember that, it's just all gone. You cannot see it anywhere. Though, although it doesn't mean I'm not going to do something about this weekend, considering that we're, there were two big bombs this weekend. Jupiter Ascending and Seventh Sun. And the fact that an animated movie took number one. So absolutely I would do a video like that. Just depends on how much time I have, because there's nobody in my house right now. There's plenty of... <sighs> that does not look like something Dan would wear, does it? And of course Dina had to be involved. Dina's like the... Dina's like some sort of antagonist for this entire game. And yes, Dan, you do look ridiculous. And Yale agrees, because Yale's like the normal one here. Moe. I don't think Dan knows what the term Moe means. I'm sure you all know what Moe means. It doesn't matter. It does, that's not the point, though. <sighs> At all. Yeah. That's, that's what you get for messing with the mad scientists. Beginning to think Lynn did it on purpose, really? That's how you feel. You know, I'm wondering whether or not I'm going to have to use the sensor bar this time, which I'm probably going to have to get a replacement one because that one's not really centered. But if you guys like that, let me know because I certainly enjoy using the sensor bars and it's not all that hard to put them in. It's just, it just takes me in a few minutes longer in editing. Oh, you can't stop the jiggling. That's too bad. Well, sure, any regular man would be confused and it would be hard to adjust to a body like this. I need, I need to like get a shelf for above my TV for my collector's editions like Persona Q. Got that wild cards edition box, which is pretty to look at. Back to the game, though. Speaking of games, I actually beat Mirror's Edge yesterday. It was a fun game. Combat was pretty good, even though I foolishly played it on normal the first time through, so I kept dying again and again and again. And the story overall was kind of minimal, but... Hey, for an experiment like that, it was pretty good. So thank you, EA and DICE. You made a really fun game. Oh, no, my nose is getting stuffier now. <sighs> I'm debating whether or not I need to censor this or not. You know, no, no, screw it. As long as it's not... As long as it's not too obvious... I'm not gonna bother. Like, the water fountain I do censor because you can see the nipples. And that's something I really need to keep in check because I have a small channel and I'm not really one to have the most supporters. I have 30 subscribers. It'd be nice if a couple more people would subscribe to me. <sighs> yeah. How do you forget about Winter? Oh, here we go again with the statue. So yeah, it's going to be censored. Yeah, if you do stay around longer, it really wouldn't surprise me if you were given extra pairs of arms. Yeah. Playing video games all day. That sounds like my excuse to get away from stuff that I want to do. Like homework. I have homework I'm supposed to be doing, but, you know, video games are much more fun. Yeah, I wouldn't expect you to be ready for tomorrow. Alright. <sighs> right, right, right. What thought occurred to you? 
Oh no, you better not be thinking what I be, what you think you'd be thinking, right? <sighs> Let's see. <sighs> Curious. God damn it, I forgot about that. <sighs> Check out your new body detail. Kill time to watch with television later. Oh, I think I'm going to need a sensor bar here, but just because the option pops up again later, I'm just going to go ahead and do the first option. Otherwise, it's just going to pop up again. <laughs> Whether you liked it or not, this was your body now. How about you wait to do that after you find out whether or not this is reversible or not. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to need a sensor bar here. Well, not need it, but... Uh, yeah, uh... You know what, I'm just gonna keep the music censored. You know what? Let's let me just let you listen. Yeah. I'd say they re these developers really knew how to freaking use music because this is just awkward now. Half hour staring at yourself. <sighs> Don't turn over to the dark side, please. Actually, when I think about it, it's not gonna matter anyways. Why are you justifying all this? Why are you justifying this? Okay, I'm muting this. I can't deal with it anymore. It's not that I don't like listening to royalty-free music. It's just that I can only deal with bad royalty-free music for so long, more, let alone in the environment that it's programmed for. <sighs> Alien Body. Oh, I actually remember this old book I used to read. Someone getting trapped in an alien's body or something? I don't remember. That was years ago. Maybe ten years ago. It's crazy. Stuff that you... You remember stuff like that as a kid, but when you're older, you don't remember it. Of course, you, you like to hide your appearance still because you don't want anyone else to know. I... Too late, he's turned over to the dark side. Yeah, when I think about it, he probably could get away with it at my school because people really are that dead unless you run into the smarter part of the community. Hey, why are you still wearing the glasses? That's right. That's This isn't gonna work. I can already tell you this isn't gonna work. Even at my school, that would not work. You, could... you know what? I'm just going to read that slideshow again. Generic slideshow. Step one, make stuff up. Step two, set stuff up. Step three, try things out. Hey, Mr. Anders, knock it off. Or at least I think that's Mr. Anders. All the mid-course material we learned about today will be on the final exam. Yeah. I would assume anything covered in class would be included on a final exam. Yeah, too much to handle, huh? Maybe you should just tell them all. Droll, monotone voice. Yeah, I can understand that. Really, not too concerned about grades. Is he that smart? Because it really doesn't seem like it because he keeps thinking up some of the kind of the most disturbing and worst ideas. Like, for instance, why can't he just convince people that he's wearing contacts instead of just wearing the glasses? 
And wouldn't it be a better idea to cut that hair? But then again, he said he doesn't like sh short hair on girls. But sometimes that's just how it is. Some, be some girls don't like that long hair. And that's not a bad thing. For far too long, people have assumed that girls should be... Uh, I forgot my train of thought. I'll just, let's just continue. Yeah, I don't see this working out. You have winter in front of you. Your appearance is way too, oh, she's judging you. Oh, now she's embarrassed, apparently. <sighs> Nothing's going on, huh? Just talking like that would throw would throw anybody in a loop. Oh, she's judging you. She's judging you. Ha! Look at that. She knows. Oh, she knows. You didn't plan this out, didn't you? Why bother? Why bother trying to hide them at this point? Why can't you just accept the fact that it's over? Oh, 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 oh. You're done. You're done. Just tell her. There you go. Winter, like, changes her face and appearance stuff way too much. This is going to be a longer episode than usual. I'm going to try and contain this into five parts. At about 20 to 25 minutes apiece. The first episode was 18. The last episode was like 21, 22-ish. This one's going to be about 25. Then the next few will probably be around 25. <gasps> well, why wouldn't she know? You apparently have similar classes. Pathology lab. I bet you wish you had. A... <sighs> okay, I hate that these characters cut me off. But again, they wouldn't have to cut me off if I didn't have autoplay on. But I gotta have autoplay on. Oh, uh, this didn't occur to me earlier. But if you saw a weird cut earlier. That was because I'm not too confident in Fraps recording this whole thing in a 25 minute chunk, so breaking it up. It only adds like a few seconds, so it doesn't really matter to me. Maybe it doesn't, maybe it doesn't change anything. Because I know you can get 20 minutes of Town of Salem out of the way with Fraps, but better to be on the safe side. Oh look, she even knew about it before. Lady, you have no idea. Pretty weird. Yes, of course you don't hear about this happening every day. Why would it? Okay, this is one thing that always bothers me with this game in terms of art. You see those eyes on Winter? They're above hair. What? the hell developers if you're gonna at least give us art that looks like this at least make it physically correct and for the umpteenth time yell has been called cute but at this time she's not cute we all know this she's technically sexy at this point of course you promise Oh yeah, you're not going to tell anyone. By the way, these choices, aside from the last one, are based off of what I would realistically do. Consider staying this way forever. I need water. Okay, there we go. Now I can, now I can feel my throat again.
I would assume being able to talk to someone would be nice. Can't really keep it a secret forever. Yeah. It, yeah, it takes a big weight off your chest. Figuratively, though, not physically. Uh, and there's Rimshot. Uh, oh yes, and all the lesbian stuff that they like to do in this game. Wait, you would never go out with a guy. Does that mean that Yale's sexual orientation hasn't changed either? <sighs> something about the hair. It's always something about the hair! Everything in this game, it's about the freaking hair that's... You know what? I'm just getting ahead of myself now. Yes, she could have ruined your life. But she did the opposite of what you expected. Because I don't think she would be that mean at this point. She just really wants attention. Uh, see, look. Exactly what I said. Uh, yeah. I, uh... complications with issues that really should be uh, <coughs> I don't know where I was going with that and how is this a big decision well you know we're gonna pick the obvious choice it would be going on the date because what do you have to lose Okay, we are. I'm seriously running low on time on this one. Yeah, let's worry about it later. Let's just have fun now. Again, why don't you use that brain of yours to think of a better idea? Okay. Thank you, Winter. Talking logically. Exactly. Thank you, Winter, for giving us this idea. Yes, see, look. This is exactly what Yale should have come up with. But then we also remember that Yale doesn't like being a girl and therefore doesn't want to dress like a girl and therefore you know that's too many therefores I'm just gonna stop there oh sure lots of fun for winter okay and it's at this point where I'm going to stop because I need to get to another game and I'm running out of time anyway so thanks for watching everybody be sure to click the annotation for the next for the last part and as always, I'll see you guys in the next part. See you later.